Ah. All right, so so uh, what are you guys? We're we're back. I think everybody's here, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So um, I tell um, Sol, Sol, uh, I think we can uh, go back to the two of us. We don't need this elf to help us. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, just the two of us can can handle any issue, right, uh, Mister uh, David Gallen? Yeah, yeah. Who this spirit or witch or whatever it right. can do anything to us? All right, go, go, go and cross the bridge again so I can follow. Go. Yes. I okay. My so where do you head yeah. out? <clears throat> ping, ping. Where you're going? Uh, I'm here. Uh, going this way. Yeah, and I'm following him. So you go inside, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna okay, keep uh, following. Him. Okay. One, two, three, four. And you follow them, uh, Jessica. All right. Do you stay literally at their back, or do you want to leave some space between you and them? Give a little bit of space so that I can stay. Safe. Like this. Yeah. Okay. So you do that. Uh, meanwhile, Faye, you're going back. So I'm gonna assume you're get, probably gonna. Are you just gonna stay there, or are you gonna keep going going back like here? Yeah, I want to keep pretending like I'm, I'm leaving. Okay, so you move that way. Um, okay, one second. Let me just uh, reveal the area a little more. So, Galleon, you're inside the tunnel, yep. a two-meter-wide tunnel, and that the tunnel um, goes south. And then you could see it can probably go uh, further east. Okay. Uh, so if you get here, you can probably go more towards the east after that. Well, I go here, yeah. All right. So as you move there, uh, right view. You could see the tunnel is going east, and then you see a door. Okay. Well, I keep going. Okay, so you move up to here. Um, Sol, do you follow him? Yes. Okay, so you're going this way. Riley, you are going. Uh, I'm assuming you're still leaving one one spot between you and the other person, right? Okay, I can't hear you, but that's fine. I'm assuming you're saying yes. Uh, we're going to okay. say you're there. We're just going to say you're there. We're going to see you're there. All right, so as you get in front of this door, you notice that there is no um, handle yeah. Yeah, to open the door, but there is a spot where, you know, like, it, it's like a, a little square at the same spot where normally you would see a handle. It's a little square, and it's uh, big enough to fit uh, a man's hand. Hmm. Uh, do you see that, uh, Sol? What do you think? Uh, that's a weird contraption. Hmm. Should we, should we head back and cut the hand of uh, one of those guys? <laughs> 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 hmm. And try to use it? That's pretty brutal what you're saying. Um, He's dead. That's true. At least, at least it will be useful in death. That's good. That's true. Um... <coughs> Can I try? Uh, I don't know uh, if it's uh, with rune crafting. Uh, my knowledge of rune crafting. If I can guess what kind so of there is no runes in there, so your rune craft totally, is completely ah, useless. For, okay. for that. But what okay. are you trying to do? Just explain to me what you're yeah, trying to do. Yeah, I'm trying to see if uh, to try to understand if uh, I put my hand is there a, like a, like. Will there be an explosion because I'm not someone who is supposed to use it? Well, or? that's too that's too specific. You know, like uh, the difficulty well, factor is going to be extremely hard. 
No, but that's you know, like if, if you're telling me, I want to know if I press this button, it's gonna launch nuclear uh, bombs ah, that are gonna that, hit that, Somalia. Like it's a little too technical, you know. Like you're saying, you're saying a box, and you're telling me if I put my hand, is it gonna blow up? No, I, are, are you saying if you put your hand, there is gonna be some form of mechanism? Yeah. Like a sure. trap or something like that. That's that's more more vague. You need something yeah. more vague. Okay, so um, you can you can do an analysis, and it's gonna be well, yeah. Just roll your analysis uh, and tell me what your total score is. So, uh, well, well, um, it's uh, twenty nine. Twenty four. Okay, so you know, as you inspect it, it doesn't seem like it's set up. To like cut the hand or anything like that. Like there is there is nowhere where you can see any any hole where you see, where you could see like a, a a blade fall on the hand or any uh, holes where flame could come out or anything like that. So it okay. doesn't seem like it's trapped to you. Okay. What do you think, Sol? Shall I put my hand in it? No, it's fine. Uh, I, I'll try mine. And yeah. Like, is there a way we can like swap places in this case, or is it too tight? Yeah, that's fine. You just you just go over him and and you do it. So you push your hand inside as you, as you touch the back of it. You feel that the back uh, is um, uh, it is not uh, very very strong. Uh, it is pushable. So as you push it, the door you know like you, you hear you hear a click and the door moves a little bit like this inside yeah. to to open towards another room that's the shittiest door i've ever seen what's yeah. up with this, door? <laughs> this handle <laughs> oh man i like going <laughs> so yeah as as you do that Doo -doo. Oh. is that a pool So as you do that, it opens to a room, and as you step inside the room, you notice that the door on the other side is a wall. It's not a door. So it's a door on your side, on the side where you came from. Oh. On, the other, on the other side, it is a wall, so it's probably a secret door. Mm. So if you came from the other side, you would have seen it as a wall, not a door. Okay. That's why there was no handle. Okay. You know. Um, so it's yeah. So you are in um, you are in this large. It's a large cellar. Um, okay. And it has uh, on these points that I'm gonna ping stone steps that go upwards. Okay. These two spots. Those are stone steps that go up. Um. And as you get in there, you notice that there is a door on this side. Um, and that is a pool or something in the middle? Yeah, hold on. I'll give you more information in a second. And you also see that there is a door in here. Next there is to the a door steps? in here. Okay. And then there is, yeah, and there is a door okay. in here. Um, so that's, uh, yeah. Yeah, and then you see at uh, the western side, so around here, you know, there is a cistern um, whose walls are lined with kegs and barrels. So, let's see. yeah, this is this right here is the cisterns. It's a rectangular, a rectangular reservoir that has uh, water in it. Okay. So that's uh, that's what you see from uh, your your angle as you get in this room. <clears throat> um, what do you think, Sol? I think we should uh, maybe explore this uh, door here first. Yeah, this one here. Yeah. Yes. Do do do. Hopla. Okay, so you guys are gonna start moving that way. You best please move your character too, you know. Uh, and and Ily also, you can move your character. Just uh, 
relocate. Yeah, you guys move your characters. I shouldn't be doing that. You guys should be able to handle that. All right, yeah. make a make a stealth test as you move there, and I'm gonna roll uh, once. We're gonna say. Oh sh. Add five points to your total score. Add five points. So my total is. Wait, what? <clears throat> oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, damn, that's uh, really horrible. Uh, so I rolled a 13. Um, okay, what's your total, Eileen? Guys, what's your total? Tell me what's your total. 39. Is. We wrote it in chat. Galleon? 13. All right. Okay. So um, you get to the door. Uh, it's a wooden door that's uh, in front of you. Mm -hmm. What do you do? Should we open the door? I mean, how is the handle? Is it similar? Is it a normal handle? With a key? Uh, no, this one is uh, a regular handle. You know, there is nothing. There is nothing uh, out of the ordinary. It's a very ordinary. Um, hold on, my my screen keeps uh, doing some stupid stuff in there. Yeah. Wow, that is that is so messed up. Oh, there you go. Now it moves. Yeah, for some reason it didn't allow me to like move my. Wait, what? There is something wrong with uh, my website, but that's fine. I'm able to fix it now. Okay, so. Um, I'm gonna have to relog. I think. Yeah, it's it's uh. It's... That's okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. I have to relog. Uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna relog because my screen for some reason I cannot move stuff around and I cannot uh, uh, unhide. Uh, meaning like I cannot show you the rest of the map. So I'll relog in a second. Are you scared? No. I'm gonna fuck them up. <laughs> no, just headbutts, and that's it. I'm already scared of uh, Usama Zakaria and his characters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? Welcome. Well, thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you, dear. I think I would vote for all your NPCs to have the voice of Pip and uh, and the other guy. What? <laughs> okay, now now we're better. Uh, so I was telling you that the door is wooden. It's a very normal door. It has a handle. There is nothing that looks out of the ordinary. You can you can if you'd like you can expect it even more. Yeah. Uh, do you want me to open it or do you want to open it, guy? Oh, I can open it. Okay. All right, to open the door. Uh, one second, let me just uh, show you. The way, let me show you the way. Hey. I should probably at one point. Uh, I should probably at one point go back to Usama and see. Yeah, I mean, you know, just how he's doing. <laughs> well, you you said you're just leaving, so I I, I just had you. It's leave. okay. I had spoof. I was good. I'm you know chilling. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, so it opens to as you open the door. Um, it, 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 it is a room that appears to be a storeroom, yeah. which has also it seems like it's a storeroom, but it has been transformed into uh, work as a living quarters because you could see there is um, well from your angle you could see a bed. In the in here where I pinged, and yeah. So, do you want to go inspect it? Uh, can you repick it? Uh, I missed it. So I said it's a room. Yeah. Now that is, it, it would be a. You see, it's a storage room mm -hmm. because you see a lot of um, uh, supply items 
uh, in here and barrels and, and and stuff like that. But you could also see two bed two beds, a bed here and a bed here. Okay, okay. That were installed, so it also li uh, works as a living quarters, like where where people um, go and sleep. And you can see that you know from what you are seeing, you can see that the covers uh, or the sheets um, uh, are you know have uh, been recently occupied, maybe you know a few hours or, okay. or so. Uh, but I was telling you that there is also some, you know, like crates inside that yeah. you can inspect if you'd like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could inspect the room, I guess. Okay, so you, so you, so you get in. Uh, you best. What did you want to say? Can you ping? Yeah. Yeah, I don't see it. See, that's the, that's what went, went wrong. Oh, uh, hold on. Uh, let's see. Because that's, that's what was confusing first mail. Yes. Okay. Now about we see now. what you think. Okay. Yeah. So that's that's the bed, and I was telling you the sheets are moved. Like if somebody slept there a few hours ago or so, and then this one. Yeah. And. Uh, okay. So you're. Uh, okay. What's up? And these things are they like red capes? Well, you can't you can't see oh, from I your angle. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Okay. All right, so you get in, uh, Galian. Uh, Yubas, are you gonna follow? Yeah. As long as okay, I'm please. Uh, obstructed. Okay, so you're gonna be following here, Jessica. You're gonna follow as well, right? Uh, we're gonna cut to Usama, and then we'll be back. Okay. Usama. Uh, so you're at this spot. Do you want to keep? Do you want to keep going back? No, I wanna. I wanna go. I wanna go dark, man. I wanna pull the curtain. Whoosh, whoosh. So what does that mean? I want to go invisible. I would like okay. to go invisible, please, Game Master. Oh, May okay. I? <laughs> yeah, no problem. So you are invisible. You know, you use your your you hold your um, necklace and you use its power, and you completely disappear. And I go back on inside. Okay. Move uh, move yourself to where you want to move. All right. So as you enter there. Uh, you notice that there is nobody in there. Everybody ha have left. Uh, last time you saw them, they were heading this way. Uh, you could, uh, as you enter, it's still cold in here. Uh, the only warmth is probably coming from the torch mm -hmm. right here. So what do you do? Can I do that? Sure. And as you get here, you hear, <laughs> sneaky one, sneaky one, I told you that nobody can hide from my eyes. Okay. All right. So as you got there, we're going back to Galleon and let's do this, this, this. Uh, no, that's number one. And that's number two. And then uh, let me just check one, uh, one quick thing in here. All right, so Galian, as you enter um, the room and you get to the position where I have you on the map. Uh... You are surprised from both sides, stabbed from both sides with um, short swords. There were three... Um, Three red brand lackeys hiding against the wall. And as you walked in, the two of them stabbed you, dealing eight damage each. So take two durability and uh, you take uh, eight damage or whatever that is from that. Uh, so they got the jump on you. Um, and then the last one is this guy. So this guy right here is moving. Uh, he's... He's hiding behind his comrade. So one, so that's uh, four, eight, 
10. Well, barely. So the last one just moves in front of you in position, and then he strikes with his sword. Uh, this one, you don't take the damage automatically. I have to roll against your, your defense. So he rolls with a, uh, a 31 plus 2. So I was successful, and then so you try, you stumble to try to block. And by the way, you probably would have failed anyway because you didn't have your hammer out to parry. And I can't hear you, by the way. I think you're. Uh, I had my uh, hammer out because I removed it. I uncheated it when uh, I heard the voices. I said, "Ah, come at me!" I grabbed my hammer. I sure, said, I grabbed sure, my hammer. Fine. And, uh... Then even when you did your parry, you were not successful. Yeah, so take another yeah. eight damage. So this one got in and stabs you uh, as well. And now we start a combat round where we do initiative. So please roll your initiative and then let's see how much uh, we're going to go. And I'm talking about uh, Jessica and, um, and Sol as well, please. Where is my... Ah! What is it? Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Something weird just happened. Oh, I didn't clear it from last time. God damn it. Okay, let's see. Well, that's fine. I can just clear it now. Clear, clear, clear. All right, here they are. Jessica? 18. No, you didn't. You know, like you click on your character and you click on initiative. I'm sorry, it's not working. What? Um, it's okay. I, ju I just did it for you. That's fine. I don't know why you're saying it's not working, but that's fine. Okay, so all of you have rolled, and we start with uh, this red brand lackey. I don't see Delia oh. in the list. Yeah. But well, you don't see the 30? No, uh, the 20. Oh, you rolled the 20? Yeah. Okay, so your 30 is probably from last session. And did you did you click on your character and on initiative uh, at the top? No, I forgot uh, that we had this on the yeah. character. Yeah, actually. yeah. Please, that's that's what you're supposed to use if you want to get uh, on, on I, there. No, no, uh, no, no. Okay. You're already at twenty. I already, uh, I already okay, set okay. it up for you. Sorry, but that's that's what you're supposed to do. Okay, uh, next time uh, I'll try to remember. That's fine. No problem. No it's problem. Let's see. Uh, let's see him. I see ID, but I don't see him. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Now, do you see him? Nope. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Uh, roll, roll a guardian. You can have uh, from the previous session. Just roll. I'm gonna change it to twenty. Voila. The bias see him. Yeah. Yeah, because I was seeing that, but it seems like you guys were not able to see it. Yeah. Oh, okay. no. okay. All right. So, <clears throat> uh, one second, uh, Galleon. Uh, let me see. Uh, let me look back at my rolls. I did against you when I attacked you. All right, no, that's fine. You're good. Okay, so the red brand, uh, the first one is this guy. He's gonna, as he sees you in, in there, he says, <clears throat> you will pay for coming here, and he stabs. Well, I'm sorry, the motherfucker. Damn. Damn. So he rolls a 17. And he deals another eight damage, so he's able to stab you again. You know, um, you take the hit, and then the other one on the other side that's flanking you, he is gonna hit as well. And he rolls. He tries to thrust his sword at you. He has a total of 27, 33. You're able to um, block it with your with your hammer, and it's uh, your turn, white hammer. Okay, so I attack uh, this guy. Top. All right. So that guy, you attack him first. Yeah. And I'm gonna try to. He's, he's gonna roll. try to dodge. He he's does. successful. He rolled 24, so you swing and he he avoids your hit. Um, are you gonna and do the... your seasoned fighter to attack somebody else? Uh, right. I try this one, and I need to. I uh, wait. Seasoned fighter. There is Just a. Just roll twice. 
-hmm. Just two, 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 two rolls and then pick uh, the lowest score. So it's nine plus uh, 17. Uh, it's 26. And he's going to dodge and he is successful. So you swing. You were surprised and shaken by what just happened, even though you didn't take any physical damage. But just being surrounded, it brought back some horrible memories, and you are you, you have missed your your actions. All right, uh, Eily Irigar. Yes, so squishy in here. Um. It is indeed. <laughs> you can try to shoot at the guy who is here, but you're gonna have to do it with a disadvantage. And if you roll a one, you're gonna hit one of your friends. And. Um... Can I do ambush? We are, you are still undetected. So I can do ambush? Sure. Um, so is it a ranged attack then? Yes, but you're rolling with disadvantage. Oh, so I have to do Yeah, because your friends are between you and the enemy. Um, okay. I have to. Okay. All right. So make two, uh, uh, what do you call that? Ranged rolls, and uh, the lowest is, okay, so your, your seven is is the, the one. So it's. So that means I did not, so I just, yeah, it's just a, a hit, 23. One second, let me, let me just quickly read ambush. It's um, only if I roll at 11 or more. Got you. Yeah, he, so because he cannot see you, he cannot dodge. And because you rolled, uh, your rollist is a 7, he still takes uh, damage. So what, uh, what, what arrow did you use? I used, I'm sorry, I used a sturdy arrow. Okay, well then roll your... Uh, 12. Yeah, 12 damage. Roll your D100. Uh, Z, uh, 1 to 17. To, seven, to 70, you're good. Above 70, your arrow breaks. Okay, good. So you shoot, you let go uh, of the arrow, and it goes in, flies over uh, Saul's head and got in, and then it hits the red brand and deals 12 damage. He has two in armor, but it still hurts as he gets, as your arrow hits his, um, his upper right shoulder. Uh, what do you do next, Jess? Uh, can I drink an energy potion? Uh, for your bonus action, yes, you can. Yeah. Please uh, make sure to do that. But uh, make sure that it's uh, a potion that's uh, on your pocket. It is. Okay. It's in my pocket. All right. And that will close your turn unless if you mm -hmm. want to move. Um, I don't think I can get in there, can I? I think, isn't soul in the door? No, you cannot. Yeah, I can't get in there. But you could decide to move away like this. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> that's why I asked. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Uh, next one is Sol. So I have a question. Uh, uh, so these barrels, I'm thinking, so these barrels are obstructing movement, right? Yes. Yeah. So as far as free cells, there's only this one and this one. No, that's not a free cell. That's a wall. Oh, that's a fucking wall. Oh, there's, no, yeah. there's actually no way I can move, right? Yeah, you can, you can, you can uh, try to push Galleon, but it's going to be difficult. Okay, but from our position, am I, uh, I... You can, cannot hit. I cannot hit. From your position, you cannot, you cannot hit, no. That's why I ambushed you like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got you. So, um, in, in this context, if I push Galleon, is there like a, a way to swap our positions by, like, by, like... No, the, like no, there is no ability for you, that you have yeah. to swap positions with him. Okay. And what happens if I try to charge this guy? Does that? No, you're gonna hit. You're gonna hit Galleon. He's on the way. No, no. I, uh, I touch Galleon and I use blessing of protection. Oh, not bad. Not bad. All right, so take I, uh, your uh, I your magic uh, points, etc. And then, uh, Galleon, you have um, well, not Galleon. Uh, you best you need to roll your magic, and the difficulty is uh, ten. So and, uh, roll. Let me roll. And you fail. 
Holy shit. <laughs> you oh, 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 oh it's one oh, and the one. It's oh, one and the one, baby. Oh man, I see that's Alright, uh then please go ahead and delete uh blessing of protection from uh, your No I'm kidding, I'm kidding. No. <laughs> no. You're not you're you're not using it. But as you touch Galleon's back and you're trying to um use your spell. It, you know, you're trying the words, you're trying the words, you're focusing, but it's, again, you do not know why you hate it here. And <laughs> now you're remembering why. It's because its glory is not around. Yeah. And you're not, you're, meaning the sun's glory is not here. Yeah. And you're fighting at night. And it is a dark space. Exactly, yeah. And it's as you focus. spell, you, you, you were saying the words, you actually make a mistake in the pronunciation of the word that makes you, for the next half hour, you cannot use a spell. Okay. It backfires. That's the 20 and the 1 failure. It's fair. Three. It's more than fair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, <clears throat> that's, uh, do you want to do a bonus action or a movement? Okay. Sounds good. That's unfortunate. That went in the way. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. I, I was I was muted. I, I want to say I want to make a movement. Uh, sure. Uh, I'll move here. Uh, just ping. Yeah. Like in the water? Uh, no, sorry. Uh, fuck. Uh, here. Is it? Well, you're gonna you're gonna have to. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Hold on. So hold on. Hold on. You best. So two, six, ten. You can move here if you go around Jessica. Okay, so these are not obstructing, right? Yeah, no, but as I'm saying, that's two. Yeah. That's four. Oh. So gotcha. that's a total of six. Gotcha. You're gonna you're gonna get yourself obstructed okay. by doing that. Right. Are you gonna say anything as we move there? What a shitty day. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, Galian, you feel that uh, Sol, who was behind you, just left yeah. his position. You know. Mm -hmm. um, all right. So that then takes us to uh, the this red brand lackey who got hit by Eilis' arrow, and he swings at Galleon with his sword. Oh man! God damn! All right. So he swings with his sword. Now this one because he rolled a nineteen. Actually, you take one piercing damage. Oh, really? Yeah, that's uh, that's part of his um, uh, oh, passive nice. abilities. Nice. So he hits you with eight, but one there is one damage, extra damage that's piercing that ignores your armor. So okay. you reduce your HP by that by that one. All right. Uh, yeah. And then uh, Usama, it's your turn. I can't hear you. Your uh, hold on. Yeah, yeah that's right. Do, do I know that they went this way, or that's where I saw them last, right? You saw them last time heading towards uh, this tunnel. Okay. Yeah, well, I guess I um, I follow the tunnel, I guess. Okay, you can move up to 20 meters, if you'd like. So that's 14 in there. 16. I'm just going to stay there. Okay, can I, so what can, what can I see? Can you tell so, me? So, as you follow, uh, as you get in the tunnel, you saw at this spot right here, you saw that there is a door that's open. You cross it, you realize everything that I explained to the team. The door is a door from your side, but from the other side, it is a wall. And as you get there, you see Eileen, you know, getting her arrows aiming. Um, on the, she's at this spot and she's aiming inside here. Okay. Um, you, you're hearing uh, swords, the sounds of weapon clashing against armor, and then you see uh, Sol climbing over a <laughs> over a um, a barrel. Okay. Do you want to say something? No. Okay. So um, you could, as I told you, you could still. You're at 16 meters. You can still move. Uh, you can still move two more squares if you'd like to. Um, this is an obstructed here. You can move this way and this way, and it's unobstructed. Yeah, I'm just gonna move here. Okay. So you get uh, you get in that position, and that's uh, uh, Usama. Please roll your initiative. 
just so I have you also as part of the, the combat because you're entered now. All right, so you have a 22 and then let's uh, descending. Okay, good. So we got you now as part of the, the combat. Sounds good. And it starts, uh, it's the start of a new turn, round two with uh, the red brands lackeys. So the guy on your left, uh, sorry, on your right, mm -hmm. Galleon is going to stab you. So he rolls 28 total. And you rolled a 29. So you barely, as the sword was about to hit to hit your armor, you barely move it away and it cuts a little bit of hair out of you. Um, so that was that one. The next one, uh, the next guy is this one. And he also tries to stab you. So he thrusts his store. And you're able to, to block it and shrug it off. Block it, block it. Uh, Osama, it's your turn. I'm uh, not doing anything for now. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna wait until the end yeah. of the turn. Yeah, because I don't know what's going on, right? Like, it, you know, I I hear sound. Yeah, you're of, you, yeah. yeah you're here you're hearing the sound of metal clashing. Right. Right. Um, it's a little muffled. So I'm gonna just. Uh, uh, yeah. So if I wanna move, return Galleon. If I wanna move, uh, I will take uh, three attacks, right? Uh, move where? Like, for example, here. Yes. I can I move here? In diagonal here? Uh, it's going to be... It's actually going to be difficult because uh, they are pretty much stopping you. Let's okay. Just put, no, let's just uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to walk back here. So, so I will say, if you want to move like here... Mm -hmm. You're gonna have to um, expand your action, mm -hmm. do a movement, and do a roll uh, of pretty much strength. You're gonna push somebody and get there, and that's it. The person is not gonna fall, but it's just pushing your way to get in that position. But you're gonna lose your action and bonus action and movement. No, I'm gonna move here. Back. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So as you step away, uh, the three of them are gonna attack you again. Yeah. So one, two, three. All right, Galleon, I, I, I rolled against you three times. One. Okay. Two. Uh -huh. And three. Okay. okay. So, so the one first there. one, um, okay, so hold on. Mm -hmm. Two people have attacked you so far, right? Yeah, so far, yeah, two. Yeah, so the first one is equal because I rolled a 19 and he has a plus one because two people have attacked you. The okay. second one is a success for me. Yeah. And uh, the third one is a success for me because 23 against 24, and I attacked you uh, four five times by that, by that point. So it's a plus, it's a plus four. Okay, okay. So two hit you, one is rerolled. So the one that's rerolled has um, plus, five. plus one. He has only plus one. I rolled a 11, fuck. So that's 25. Okay. And you're okay. So two hit you, <clears throat> and the rest didn't hit you. Okay. So take two armor uh, and eight damage each. I'm assuming it doesn't deal any damage yeah. to you, right? Because of your armor. But I'm working your armor. Don't worry. It's going <laughs> to be broken by the end of this. <laughs> Uh, all right, so, so you move away, uh, and you know, like you, you move that way. Do you want to stay there, or do you want to move away from that position? No, I want to move away from that position, actually. So, if I can, <sighs> uh... can I just tell me where you want to go. Uh, actually, you expanded four movements to to get where you are. Because if I go here, uh, Sol cannot cannot uh, pass in front of me. Or can he? If I where move here, like, uh, like he cannot at uh, as uh, unless if he pushes as of this point. But uh, you know, if other people there move also, 
yeah, that can open the floor for that. OK, so I'll move there. And uh, okay. do I do something? Oh, that's it. Ah, oh, wait, I, can, I still have my action. I can do my action, right? Or a yeah, moment, sure. Uh, uh, OK. <clears throat> uh i use um because i'm next to uh soul i'll use a blessing of might sure on on who on yourself on, uh, or on, soul. Soul? on soul on soul okay uh please go ahead take out the ep or mp or whatever it is so it's a magic roll i'm assuming right yeah magic and it's against 10. Okay. <sighs> no really <laughs> these these blessings that you guys are trying to use, none of them is working. <laughs> there is, you get you get you, you get a feeling that there is a disruption with the force right now, and, and yeah. it's probably because of the stress. The stress you're you're thinking again about how you you know you're you're, you're brave, but uh, you're thinking again about how you were ambushed last time and how you got ambushed again, and you keep thinking, why did I get ambushed? I shouldn't be ambushed. I shouldn't have been. And and as you're thinking about that, you're not able to throw your spell correctly. Okay. He tells and me to stop crying turn. all the time. My turn. <laughs> yeah, what do you do? <laughs> so um, I'm just going to shoot this guy and then move if it's OK. What arrow? A goblin arrow. Um, OK, there we go. I did. You're OK, you attacked him. All right, I'm going to see how he's going to do. Let's uh, Let's dodge, baby, let's dodge. He rolled a twenty-one, so he is successful in avoiding your 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 hit. So you shoot at him, and he dodges your arrow. Um, what do you? Uh, please roll your d one hundred, and then uh, what are you gonna do? Oh, broke. Oh, no one broke. <laughs> By the way, you don't have goblin's arrows anymore, do you? Yes, I do. Oh, you do. Okay. Yeah. So it broke. Uh, what do you? What do you do? And then now I want to I want to move, um, so I'm gonna. Can I go back here? Just ping it. There. Yeah, yeah, you can. That's uh, clear terrain. So you move away, and you don't have an angle on them anymore. All right, and uh, that's uh, Eileen's turn, and then that red brand lackey. So, is there anybody who has an angle on them? Hmm. They have to come out. All right, I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make. Uh, there is Ahmed's intelligence, and then there is uh, Red Brand's intelligence. So let, <laughs> let me, let me, let me do an, an intelligence roll for Red Brand so that they don't do what Ahmed wants to do. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna say that maybe they are dumb. Uh, so their intelligence is twelve, and we're gonna roll against uh, a fifteen. So um, I'm gonna roll for them. That's their roll. That's the difficulty factor. All right, let's take a look. So I said twelve against fifteen. All right, so they failed their intelligence test. Yeah. What did you, you know what Ahmed, to... you know what yeah. Ahmed was gonna do? He's gonna, he's gonna come here, close the door, and tell you fuck you guys. You wanna, you wanna come come fight us? We're not well, gonna sorry, come out. Sorry. I was like, yeah, just close the door and block <laughs> it. And leave the no, we're not. We're, we're not gonna. We're not gonna fight you. You, you come here. You know. So they feel they feel brave. They feel like they can they can take you because they've been sp they, they've been stabbing Galian. So this one moves there. Whoa, 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 uh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, he moves oh, sorry. Uh, he mo us, uh, he like uh, we cannot hit him? <laughs> you know, he, he moves um, here pretty much. Actually, hold on. No, he's going to move here, and he's going to try to defend against your hit, uh, Guardian. Yep. So take an opportunity attack on him. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Good I'm going to try to dodge... Yeah, and uh, you are successful. Yeah, so you hit him. You deal ten damage. I'm assuming ten right? magical. Ten magical. That's fine. Doesn't doesn't do protection. Protects against magical. Okay, so I am. As he runs by you, he gets slammed in the in the back of the head with the hammer. You know, 
and he looks very dizzy, like ba barely able to stumble, and he stops here. As he turns, you know, he just he, he took an arrow from Eile, he took a hammer hit to the head, he really doesn't look good. Um, okay, uh, who's next? Next is uh, Sol. Doesn't Sol get another opportunity? Did he ran by Sol no. too, right? No. He's, uh, he's, he's still in, uh, in Sol's uh, um, control area. Uh, however, uh, the he can still attack. He didn't attack. Oh yeah, that's true. No, good, uh, good call, you best. Uh, yes, he is gonna attack you. Thank you for being honest. So you get the plus. He is gonna melee attack you. You best just wants to generate uh, retaliation. Though, no, 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 no. <laughs> right. Why would I risk it, especially with my twenty and one? No, 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 no. no. Rod, roll, 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 baby, roll. All right, so he hits you. Take one one durability and eight damage. And now is your turn. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, is you best going to split another red brand? Or maybe is he going to murder another sword. one? Another one. He's going to break his sword. <laughs> All right, I'm going to attack him, obviously. Uh, so... And he tries to dodge, and he barely avoids you. Best you. By the way, you had a plus one because uh, Galian just attacked. Yes. You swing with your sword, and he ducks, and he barely uh, avoids it. And he realizes, oh shit! As he saw, you know, like your sword flying, and it hits. It hits. Um, uh, your sword hits the wall here as you swung, and you could see, you know, like some light come out from the impact. And he is a, a, a little concerned. Uh, Usama, it is your turn, I believe. I'm still not doing anything. I'm just you're watching. gonna stay there, or are you yeah. gonna move? Where are you gonna? Do? No, I'm staying there. Okay, you're gonna stay there and watch. Sure. Uh, next is um, well, in that case, you're back here. So the red brand lackey, this this one is gonna move here. And uh, so he's going to move in that, and then he's going to try to attack uh, Galleon. Okay. <clears throat> and that's his uh, his roll, a 28 total. <sighs> Oof. So he swings at you. Galleon, by the way, you're on top of a, <laughs> of a barrel. <laughs> and as he swings, you, you blocked him. You block him. And then for a second, you're thinking, wait, is this a barrel of ale? Because you feel oh. there's a liquid inside. <laughs> Anyway, so that's uh, that's that, and then the next one is this red brand who gets at this position, and then he um, he strikes with his sword. The bra. Oh, 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 oh. 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 <laughs> And I think that's where they are starting to realize. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. You, know, <laughs> that's like, you he, were in the room. <laughs> he, he tries to stab you. You know, stumbles, hits the the sword against the wall, and the sword fell, fell falls on the ground. Hey, he, he doesn't uh, have his sword in his hand. Yeah, it falls on the ground. And he's like, oopsie. <clears throat> oopsie, oopsie. Bendy. Faye. Just passing. Okay. Uh, Galleon, it's your turn. I'm uh, watching the show. See, uh, see the <laughs> fighter and uh, we'll Why not? Because you're, uh, you're, you're, uh, you're being a ninja, Usama. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, okay, thinking, so I'm thinking to myself, <laughs> well, they wanted to knock on the door. Let's see them knock on the door. <laughs> I will uh, hit uh, this one. This Ping one. it! I can the, okay. the, uh, the one you yeah. Okay, he has sure. No sword. Yeah. So he can dodge. Well, he's gonna dodge. He's gonna yeah. try to dodge. He's not parrying. <laughs> he's gonna try to dodge. Yeah, and then uh, I'll attack with the seasoned fighter. The other one. Oh, you, you, you! Oh, yeah, that was your thirty-two. Got you, got you, got you. So you yeah. hit him, yeah. and then you attack the one next to him. All right. So the one next to him, I'm gonna try to dodge as well. Ten plus. Oh boy. Plus seventeen. 27. Well, that was not good. I think you're, you're going to hit both of them, right? Yeah. 27, you said. Okay, so you hit you, you hit both of them and you deal 10 damage each. Um, yep. Surprise! <laughs> so you hit the first one in the face and you saw a tooth flying. And you hit the second one in the, in the chest. And as they got hit by your two strikes, they start looking at each other and they say, Fuck! It's, it's the dwarf! And I, I think... Oh fuck! We didn't see that. And the other one says, 
yeah, it's the murderer, as he points to, to Saul. You know. <laughs> the serial killer yeah. who kills children <laughs> <laughs> and little teenagers. Oh. <laughs> exactly. He's a bad guy. Ailey. He's a bad guy. Ailey, what do you do? I want to shoot that guy. All right, with uh, um, what arrow? With a regular arrow. Regular? Well, he, yeah. that guy is the most banged up in the group. Oh, well, then Goblin. Okay, just so you know. Thanks. All right, roll it, and then he's going to try to dodge. You have a plus uh, one to, to whatever your total is. Nice. Uh, you're successful. I rolled a... Fuck, I rolled a two. Uh, two. Uh, Ailey, <laughs> you, you uh, break your, your, uh, your arrow, but you got him. Do you want to kill him? Yeah. All right. Yeah. So it stabs him in the back. And he's like... Fuck. And he falls to the ground. Into the pool. Yeah. Made in Morocco from Chile. Alright. Uh next. Who's next, friends? Uh next is well Ailey, do you want to do anything else? Do you want to move? Do you want to run away? You can run away if you'd like to. Do you wanna open more doors? Seriously, <laughs> uh, what more do you want to do? I'm asking. More doors. I can't hear you, Jess. I'm done. Okay, sounds good. All right, next on uh, the, the turns that... is um, this one the lackey that just uh, got killed. Yeah. And then it's Sol. Yeah, so uh, I'm going to first attack this guy and then season fighter this guy. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you must raise his, uh, his sword. <laughs> Ready <Yeah>. to cut. <laughs> And that guy, uh, and this guy in front of you, tells you, "Come on, me, bro, bro." And that was the last thing he said as he got cleaved like this, ah, and falls. I'm assuming you want to kill him, right, you best. Yeah, let's keep it. Yeah, consistent. so you cleave that guy, and the other ones say, "Benoit, no." <laughs> <laughs> And the other guy is gonna try to to, to dodge. C'est Roger le deux l'autre. And twenty five, and you slash at him, and he avoids it, and he says, "You will not have me. You had Benoit and Ro Roger, <laughs> but you will not have François." <laughs> We are the English and they are the French, or what? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, okay, it's uh, it's Francois' turn, who, you know, like in an angry way, he decides to stab uh, Saul, but the game master tells him, no, focus on Galleon, so you break his armor, and he attacks Galleon. Ooh. And he's at a 26. 32? And you're at 33, you block his sword, and he's like, why me? <laughs> oh, Sam, it's your turn. What are you, uh, I'm assuming you're, you're, <laughs> you're, what? you're not gonna, you, you don't want to use your, you don't want to take out your invisibility right now on these lackeys, you know, well, you, you don't want to. <laughs> I'm thinking, this is kind of, that's cool. It's like, I, I'm thinking to myself, shit, I don't have popcorn. <laughs> All right, so Galian, it's your. Uh, I think it's your turn. Yeah, it's. It well, is. I'm at the king. Uh, <clears throat> Twenty-eight plus one. No, why plus one? Because he got attacked by Ubis. No, ah, he dodged. That was last turn. Yeah, that's why he dodged. Ah, and that's okay. okay. Ah. And he is a sixteen. Ooh. He tries to dodge, but but the death of Roger and Benoit <laughs> has uh, has broken his soul, and he gets hit with your ten damage. And he doesn't look good. You, you heard as you hit him in his shoulder, you, you heard a, a bone cracking. Cool. Uh, 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 little pinky will make you pay, dwarf. Nah. It's um, Eilie's turn. Finish him. <laughs> yeah, I think so. With what? Okay. Um, with a regular arrow. Is it wait, how bad is he? How bad is he? Aye, aye, yeah, yeah, he looks he looks very banged up. On the verge of okay. dying. <laughs> then it's a goblin arrow. All right. Well then uh, roll and he's gonna be like, I will not be killed by a woman. <laughs> yeah, As he gets the sword and <laughs> the arrow in his plectrum. <laughs> not a woman. 
I guess he was. Uh, I guess uh, Francois was a misogynistic piece of shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like he deserved to die. <laughs> oh man! All right, so you guys have uh, cleared it out, and with that, uh, so one, two, three, four. Everybody give gains four points uh, for experience points. Osama, even though you didn't fight, the fact that you were watching what happened, you're still gonna gonna gain four experience points. Okay. You're studying their movements. All right, so you have you have killed them. What do you do now? Well, I inspect the room that I was supposed to inspect earlier, but they couldn't. <laughs> okay, so you go to inspect it. You best, what do you do? I inspect the bodies and help uh, okay. Ailey retrieve the arrows. Okay, Ailey, what do you do? I wanted to get my dirty <laughs> arrow out of the room where Galleon's in. Okay, so you go, you recover it. Uh, you best, you found... Uh, as you inspect uh, the, um, the red brands. Uh, let's see, I'm going to roll them here. Three, six. You found eight gold pieces on them, a total of eight gold pieces. And you find the short sword that they, that, that they have on them. Yeah, so let's just automatically distribute two gold pieces each. Like... You know, just to, to, to the to Sure, the yeah. Uh, every, uh, well, no, um, Usama is invisible. I know, but we can rubbish Mansash for this Okay, sure. Everybody take two gold pieces, I guess. Thanks. It's just quality of life stuff, not really RP. I understand you. Okay. Well, next, uh, by the way, uh, it's fine to do it right now, but like next time, just put it in a note because it, it breaks the RP. And uh, it is possible that she, uh, Usama at, uh, later on needs that extra two gold pieces for something. And if he doesn't recover it, he doesn't recover it, you know? So um, we're, we're going to be fine for now. Okay. Um, so that's <laughs> what you've. <laughs> 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 Yeah, ça dépend comment ça se passe ça. Yeah, but you're getting experience anyway. You know, like yeah, that's yeah, not yeah, that's good. That's good. <laughs> All right, so as you guys, uh, as uh, um, Galian, you inspect the room, you find some red cloaks. Mm -hmm. You know, on the floor, um, you find an additional. Uh, five, seven, and ten. So you find uh, that's uh, twenty-two. You find an additional twenty-two gold gold pieces in okay. in the room, scattered around. You know, hidden under under their beds, and that's about it. So I share the gold with the other people. Yeah. The, the by the way, just so you know, the um, the barrels here. If you inspect them, you see they that they have uh, some apples in there and some potatoes. You know, they it's pretty much supplies for them to cook and make food here. Okay. All right. So you said you shared the gold with the with the team, right? Yeah, it's uh, five gold each, and uh, one of them takes uh, six. Or, uh, so who's the one taking six? Just call it. Call somebody to take six. For your troubles, Galian, you take six. <sighs> I take All right. six. Okay. All right, Galian <laughs> takes six, and the rest takes uh, take five. Uh, all right. So wait, hold on. No, that's 21. I said 22 gold pieces. Ah, you said 22. Uh, I said, uh, 22. Somebody else takes six. Yeah, someone else, yeah. I need take six. Yeah. All right, good. So you finished uh, inspecting this room. That's pretty much uh, what's in there. Okay. <clears throat> right, that was a good fight. Have we had um... the bodies in the room? Sorry, what's that? Shall we hide the bodies in the room? I asked the team. Oh, mm -hmm. not a bad idea, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Close all right. So... How does the how does the pool look? Is the pool all red? Okay, so you wanna the the blood the let, we're gonna say the blood didn't spatter on the pool. Okay. Nice. And uh, let's and unlock the door. Uh, Jessica, um, make a perception roll for me, please. Uh, then let me check this one thing here. Make a perception roll, and then I'm gonna make this. So ten. Okay. Uh, all right. So you, you did notice when you were uh, earlier when you were at this spot, you didn't notice that there was a door here. Okay. 
Hey guys, there's a door over here behind me. Okay, but we close this yeah. one, right, Ahmed? Yeah. Oh, you close that door. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. that sounds yeah. good. No, that that makes sense. All right. Well, let's find right. the door. Yeah. You, you do know that on uh, on the floor here there is there is blood splattered on the floor. Just saying. Uh, it's fine. We can, uh... It's oh. wine. It's wine. They're French. It's wine. It's red wine. Oh wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> uh, let me see. Uh, can I use like a a, a, a jet d'intelligence to see if I. Uh, use some of the ale in the uh, barrels and spill it if it will help mask the, the blood uh sure uh, do an, an analysis test mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. and uh, also uh, as you do that whoever killed the character just add it to your um yes. kill count yes, yes. on your notes just make sure that it's uh, you put uh killed one human or whatever killed uh, one red brand or uh, you know just just don't just put one. Put one, but explain what yes, it is, yes. you know. Okay, uh, and I... then you're going to do an analysis test, you bus, and it's going to be against uh, 12. Yeah, just just to uh, clear the assumption, I killed only one, right? No, you killed two. No, yeah, you killed no, one. I killed, yeah, I killed I one. I killed, killed one, and I killed one. Yeah, yeah. one each. Okay. So you need to roll, you need to get 16 or more for, for your total. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that means it's, okay, 12. Okay. Okay. All right, you're successful. Uh, the air will not work, but you did notice that one of the barrels had red wine. Ah. And you can probably spill that barrel, you know, in the area, and it, you know it will it will fool them initially. But if somebody like really inspects it, they will realize that it's blood. Yeah. So I do. Uh, so I'm like, guys, hold on. Uh, I have. I need, we need to cover this. I I do that, and and you know, to the best of my abilities. As as he is trying to do that, Galian, you have an urge to drink from that wine. Well, I oblige myself. <laughs> okay, so you drink and you spit it right away. It's fucking shitty uh, red wine made by humans. Ah. Nothing like the good old ales. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. So you bet you are able to do that. Now, what's next? Can I do camouflage yes, again? Yeah. Uh, sure. Yes, you can. Uh, please uh, take out your five EP, and then we're gonna roll. Uh, you bet. What were you gonna say? I look at Galian, and I'm like, in this time. I take the front, <laughs> and then I move here. <laughs> ah, if you want, it's fine. Uh, I was fine in the front too, don't worry. I... Sure. You best move yourself there, please. All right. uh, Galleon, follow him, and uh, just you roll. Um, and then I said, what, what are you doing? Camouflage, right? Okay, so... Yeah, you're successful. You're camouflaged. So, you hide. You stay in the back. And you keep your presence reduced. Um, obviously, Galian, you're be you're behind you're in front of her. You can see her, but somebody who's further away cannot see her. She you okay. notice that she is hiding pretty well for somebody who is clearly exposed. Osama, you can you can move your character too if you want to follow them. Uh, just move here. Yeah, just you you can move your characters. Just wanted to tell you that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. All right, so. Now, you guys are... Are you going to open the door? Yes, I open the door. All right, give Choo -choo. me a second. <laughs> Wonderful. So what I need to do is pretty much this. Huh? This looks weird. Um, so it looks weird because what's directly in front of... Uh, um, oh, in front of you, Bess, are the stairs going up? You see, there are the ah, stairs. Both. The stairs are up above the door. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so um, technically, the stairs are like this. Yeah. Okay. You yeah. see that? So the stairs yeah. go up. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, so it's a door under under the stairs. Okay. And then where we are gonna do is this. So as you guys get inside, um, is that a door in front of Sol? 
in front of Sol. Yeah. Where? Ping it. Here? Is this a door? No, it's not, it's not a door. It's a wall. Okay. Sorry. Okay. There is a door here. You could see a door, a wooden door over here. Uh, I didn't see you ping. Uh, I, don't sure. see, I don't see it. Uh, uh, hold on. I don't see you ping. Here. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you get in the room, and um, a thick dust covers the flagstones of this somber hallway. It's a hallway. Uh, the walls are decorated with uh, four columns every um, every three meters, or I would say every every four meters. Just just make it simple. And then there is a double door at the west end of the hall, um, mm -hmm. and uh, where you can see sheeted in copper plates. Uh, now it's a little green uh, with age. That's fancy. Uh, a relief uh, carving of a mournful angel graces the door, like a, an angelic creature with with uh, exactly. with um, white wings. So, should we go and inspect that? Yeah, sounds to me like uh, the way to go. Let's go. Wonderful. So move uh, your characters. Ailey and uh, and Usama also, please move your characters. Usama. Okay, so you're not even going in? Uh, not for now. Okay, sounds good. Um, Sol, uh, please make a perception roll. Do I do one uh, two or just sold? No, just sold. Okay. What's your total? Uh, 27? 27, right? Yeah. Okay. So um, as you guys move there, I want to say when you are here, You best, as you go to this location, the soul, the, the the floor under you opens up and you fall. Ah! There is a pit trap in the middle of the hallway that is hidden, and you. Uh, that's why I asked you to roll your um, your uh, perception. Yeah. Perception. Now, Galian, you're you because you were like really in, at his butt. I'm gonna make you do a roll, but you're gonna have a reaction before before him. He's falling. Okay. The second one is not uh, needs to do a reaction, so you're gonna have to do an agility test against um, against fourteen. Okay, let's roll this. I rolled a one, so you are able to back up last minute. <clears throat> Meanwhile, uh, your friend fell. All right, so you fell how many meters down? You fell about you fall about four meters down on a dirt floor, and you take twenty piercing damage. You're on the floor, you're landing prone. Are you okay? Actually, hold on, you best, hold on. Um, make an agility test. Okay. It's against 22. Oh, wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> you take zero damage. <laughs> yeah, so, so as you are... Uh, as you are falling, you put your hand, you grab a titsy bits, but you smack your face against um, against the wall. You did not fall at the bottom. You're still at the top, and you take five piercing damage. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you didn't take the twenty. Here, I can help you. Uh, because he's where, where are you going to help him? He's he's on this side. Uh, where is the trap? He's not. Uh... Oh yeah, sorry, I didn't show you what the trap is. Is the four uh, squares? Oh, yeah. ah, that's okay. the trap. Shit. Yeah. So, so I'm clinging exactly here, right? Yes. Okay. okay not done. Dennis. Make a make a strength test now to carry yourself up, and the difficulty factor is ten. Please don't fuck up. Please don't. What? Twenty five. Okay. <laughs> 32. So you uh, carry yourself up and you get here. I have, a, I have a bad question. 
What? I shouldn't probably not ask this question. What's your question? Nah, <laughs> she's gonna hate me. <laughs> you was gonna hate, hate me. Oh, I don't know what the answer is. Um, was the sword uh, in any way, shape, or form helpful or hindering his movement? Ah, oh, that's a great question. No, it didn't, but the sword is down. You never said you're putting your sword back, right? Yep. The sword is is in the the pit. Ah, oh, shit. I have a I have a sword in my backpack. Can I throw it to him? The pit is, by the way, is five meters um, deep. So part of the reason why you t you were gonna take twenty piercing damage is you're not expecting to fall. Like if you if I'm expecting to fall two meters, I I should be able to handle it better because I'll try to roll, etc. But when you're not expecting to fall and it, the floor just opens, bam, you fall face first. That's why you were gonna take twenty meters. It's still possible. It would have been great if you had a rope. Always bring a rope, but <laughs> you know. Always bring a rope with you. <laughs> Don't we have a rope? Nobody no, the rope is with uh, the prisoners. Ah. Unless if uh, any one of you uh, guys has a rope. Do I have a rope? I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna be nice. I'm gonna be really nice, and I'm gonna say that in the, um, in the room where you guys murdered uh, the the red brands, there is uh, not rope, but there is um... ladder. No, no hold on. The... The, covers. the blankets could yeah. be the, the blankets could be used as... ah yeah uh, well we can go yep. back uh, there and uh... yep. let's go get the blankets and yeah okay so you get that I'm gonna just uh, pa pass the time you, you you took the blankets you tied knots in them and then you went back now you're able to retrieve your your sword your best so you're Thank able you. to finally retrieve it also just so you know and at these spots right here yeah and here you know by the wall there is a little ledge where you guys can walk it's it's uh, about um half a meter okay it's about half a meter wide so that's probably where people go around this um this, this trap mm. mm -hmm. well i join the soul then on the other side and as uh, one of you gets uh, close to to these, you notice that there is uh, it's it's not uh, it's not really clear, but you notice that there is uh, a torch that actually is a lever. Ah, it is a lever; it's to... movable, up or down. What? Maybe anyway, uh, Jessica uh, and, and the rest of the team, if you want to move, please move yourself and then tell me what you want to do. I don't move. I stay where I am. Okay. Jessica, you stay where you are. Okay, you move there. Uh, Galleon and uh, Sol, I just hang it out. Move to the door. Uh, analyze the door. Second trap. <laughs> So you're you're at the door. Um, what well, what do you mean analyze the door? What are you trying to do? Like just well, looking at it because it's uh, it, it's, it's an, an, a, as I said, it's a double. Um, yeah. Does it have a handle or okay. something? Or it's a double door. It has two handles in the middle. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, and it's uh, really fancy. And uh, as I said, uh, there, there is a relief ca carving of a mournful angel that graces the door. It's it's a, an old door. Um, it is green now with age. Can I can I uh, do a, a, a knowledge check, on, a religious check on the significance of the statue, if it rings a bell? It's not a statue; it's a relief, but uh, uh, it's a carving. Okay. Sure, you could you could you could do um, a religion test. Yeah, success. So, success, failure. Yes. Success. I have success. success. Okay. okay. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. So I, you just tell me uh, after. Okay. So um, this, in in mo many religions, the gods are depicted a little bit like this. But this is, you know, like they they believe that the gods have messengers 
uh, in, in many religions, and those messengers are winged creatures. Um, so, so that's what this is depicting. But more specifically, seeing the the way it is set up, it's probably in in your mind, based on what sh you are seeing and how and how it's depicted, is probably the entrance of uh, either a religious place or a place where we put the dead, like a crypt. So it's either like a, a small little chapel or a crypt uh, that's gonna lie behind it. So what do you do? I, I, I explained that uh, whispering to Galen. Okay. Um, do you think, shall we just open the door? Uh, yeah. But given the supernatural nature of the voice, I think, uh, yeah. Oh, I forgot to ask you something, uh, Game Master. Am I allowed to do use Monster Roar to have any no? No, no, it's too vague. Never mind. Never mind. It's too vague. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Yeah, let's open the door. Uh, let's so, open the door. So the two hands are doing like this, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, and uh, so but there is no like uh, a normal contraption, like the hand or a lever. Let's head up. Uh, you can you can try to see to make uh, like the perception to try to spot yeah. anything that's yeah um, it's against uh, because it's carved and stuff like that. I'm gonna say it's against seventeen. It's a little harder. Okay. It's lost. Oh. Oh, la, la, la. Oh. You forgot about perception. <laughs> you you become and, blind. <laughs> yeah. As I rolled a twenty and you rolled your second uh, twenty and one elbow session. <laughs> You know, like, you, you look at it, and you're like, God, I hate this place. That's what you keep thinking to yourself. I hate this place. It's too dark. I can't see sh shit. I can't see shit. And I just fell, and, yeah. That's that's pretty much it. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> can we try to... But you see door... door but you see yeah. the handles. There are handles yeah. that... Uh, so we take each one uh, handle, and uh, we pull the door? I'll do whatever you say, man. I'm so pissed. I don't even want to think. Go ahead. Yeah, let's do All this. Right. Let's the doors. So, uh, so you open the door. Open the and door. You guys, and you guys head inside. But as you head inside of the... Um, Nani. The room. Uh, let's see. The room. The room. There are three... So uh, you can see the room, right? No. Nope. I didn't uh, yeah, it's hidden. reveal the area. Okay, I'm sorry. I thought that I revealed it. We went in the dark because uh, so lost all perception. <laughs> yeah, well, that's <laughs> why. So as you get inside of the room, there are three large sarcophagi stand within the dusty crypt. Damn. Um, so it is a crypt as you get inside. And these are the... I mean, you can see the sarcophagi, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, in addition, that's a weird place. Really weird place. Wait, what? Wait, what? Uh, let's see. Select. It's Friday then. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. What? <laughs> What? You know. so, <laughs> so as you get uh, as you get inside, as I told you, there were uh, three large sarcophagi, and you see four red brand bandits that are sitting on wooden chairs around a, sar a sarcophagus. Uh, this one, more specifically, yeah. and they are playing with dice as, as you guys open the door and venture in. They turn and look at you, uh, initially expecting to see, you know, like. A member that they know, but as they see you get inside with your weapons drawn, because nobody yeah. has said, you know, they and 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 at that moment <clears throat> you realize, Galleon, this this guy was the leader in that group yeah. that fought you. Uh, yeah, this yeah. guy was the guy fighting you, and this guy too was one of the guys that were fighting you. And as they turn, they say, they look at you and they say, What the fuck? What the fuck are you doing here? 
I'm coming to kill you. Hey. <laughs> this is time. Just... <laughs> All right. Well, that's uh, that sounds good. Looks uh, <laughs> the false column along the walls. Yeah. So you could also see in here that there are false columns along the walls that are carved in the image of a spreading oak tree. Uh, there is a uh, there is a door behind this guy. There's uh, another door uh, I don't here. See your ping, uh, oh, sure. Your, your pings aren't happening. Yeah, that's fine. There's a door behind this guy. Uh, still not happening. Well, here. Mm, not happening. Not happening. Oh yeah, got gotcha. you. Yeah. The door behind this guy. Okay. And the door here. Okay. All right, so I think we're gonna do this combat, and then after that we'll we'll call it uh, we'll call it uh, with the with the session. All right. Okay. Okay. Uh, so uh, please, everybody, roll initiative and do it the meta the way I explained to you how to do it. And if you can't, that's fine. We'll we'll fix it. Do you want me to to, to do it, too, Ahmed? Uh, sure. I'm gonna go back. See. I'll be right back. Let me see. All right, so we got Eile, we got this red brand that I should have cleaned. We got this other red brand that I should have cleaned. We got this other red brand that I should have cleaned. Ahmed. Yes, sir. We said my after fish for Kenny. For Kenny, if the jungle leak, if League of Legends, like jungle leak, she flay and keep her ass on like flicks pay. Leech, the leech, 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 leech and XP. Leech and XP. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But but think my job here is done. Yeah, that's not, that sounds about right. That sounds that sounds about right. All right, so uh, top of the round is Soul. Okay. Okay, okay, Al Habib. Uh... Uh, Jessica, you rolled as well, right? What was your total? It was, I did it the way you told me to. Oh, uh, but what was it? 17. Okay, good. Yeah, just double checking. Oh. All right, uh, you best, you go first with your 33. What do you do? So, uh, one, mm. two, three, four, five. I I'm just calculating my head before moving, so I'm just uh, thinking. Uh, let's see. Okay, can I? I'm gonna do this. Uh, no, uh, sorry, do it again. One, no, uh, voila, like this. Make sense? Sure, yeah. All right. So you get in that position, and then what do you do? And then I attack uh, this guy. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, let's uh, do that. He's gonna try to dodge. Okay. Dodges. All right. So you you swing with the sword, and he's able to avoid to avoid it. Yep. Um, I'm assuming you're doing seasoned fighter, right? Yes, please. On the other guy, which is this guy. Okay. He's gonna try Ooh. to dodge. No, no, I I miss because. Fail. Yeah. Yeah, you missed with the one. So as you swing, you swing too hard. Your sword, um. You know, the guy avoids you, you swing too hard, it hits the floor, and it comes out of your hand. It falls on the floor. Yep. So you don't have your sword in your hand. You need to, uh, pretty much next turn, you need to expand your bonus to be able to um, uh, carry carry uh, it. Uh, can't I no, you cannot do it. You cannot do it now. No. Okay. You moved. Because you rolled the one. Because uh, I rolled the one. No, no. Moving hasn't uh, rolled the bonus. No, moving doesn't okay, take okay. your bonus. Because okay. you rolled the one. All that's right. why. That's it on my side. All right, uh, so that's you. Next one is uh, the Red Brand Rufian by you, Ubus. So um, uh, let's see. He oh, is shit, going I can't, to... I can't parry now. <laughs> to dodge. Yeah, but you can dodge. No, I know, but I can't parry. Can't yeah, he, he, he moves this way, okay? Yeah. And then um, he is going to strike at you with his double attack. So do two. And By the way, your retaliation at a zero now. Yeah, yeah, no, of course I know. Every new fight. Yeah. Uh, 
Right. So. <laughs> everybody lost. <laughs> yeah. Well, no, not everybody lost. Uh, he lost. Uh, so, so he missed his, both his attacks, and w in one of them, he tries to stab you with um, with his knife, and um, you know, like you dodged it, and he stabbed so fast, his knife came out of his hand. So he needs to expand also a turn. Throwing knife. <laughs> and I look at him. I'm like, I know what it's like, my dude. <laughs> Guys, somebody's a cat now. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, no, he's, there was he, a cat. <laughs> Yeah. All right. So the lucky next to him is gonna attack you, Ubes. Okay. Ubes with the dodging moves. <laughs> no. <sighs> Man. Bad. All right. I rolled a seventeen, so he stabs you, and it takes eight uh, eight damage and one armor, one durability. Yep. Okay. Uh, next on the line is the thug. So the thug. Expands. Uh, how much does he need to expand for that? Where is it? Let's see. There you go. He he uses five EP. Well, uh, I shouldn't tell you that, but he uses his uh, technique, and he ordered this guy to attack you again. He says, "He says, come on, you can do it. Hit him!" And that guy reacts and throws another attack at you, you best. Yep. So he is going to. Melee attack you. So I rolled a 14, but he has to re-roll because it's with a disadvantage. Oh, okay. Yeah, so it's the 14 that counts, I think. Yeah. Uh, which is 28. And you best you rolled how much? 13. So it's uh, it's equal. Yeah, because of the two previous attacks. Heck. Yeah. Yeah, because there were uh, two previous, and this one is the third. So it's equal, mm. and we have to re-roll, which means I have to re-roll again with disadvantage. So technically, it's the same guy. Does it still count? Yeah. Okay. Donk, 27, yeah. Ooh! But it doesn't yeah. count, right? It's a 27. Well, yeah, 27 is what counts, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, so you're able to dodge. You are able to dodge it, um, but it was it was close. It was very close because the first roll, you guys were equal, so he came very close to hit you with his sword. Yeah. Now that red brand that did that ordered this, he comes to melee with you, you best. Mm -hmm. um, no, actually, he doesn't. He draws his sword. Oh, oh boy! That's what he does because he he couldn't. Um, he didn't have his sword drawn. All right, next, um, next here is the last red brand man. You get, you guys rolled low this this fight. Yeah. Or I rolled high, one of the two. All right, so the last red brand is going to move here, and he's gonna swing at you again, Ubus. Mm -hmm. Twenty-seven, twenty-seven. He's successful. It hits you with uh, eight damage. Yes. <clears throat> All right. So next is Faye. Faye. Uh, you are muted. Mute. You're muted. You're muted. Uh, You're so. muted. Yeah, yeah. I know. How much time has gone by since they went in there? Uh, I would say about well, since since they were in this room, it was about fifteen minutes. Oh, okay. Well, then I, um, I'm just gonna start moving this way. All right, then move your character. You can move up to twenty s speed. All right, Osama, make a perception roll. Because you don't know that there is a trap there. But the trap is not open? Uh, let's see. Because we didn't choose uh, Yeah, the, it is, uh, it, is uh, it is still open. Okay, so you see you see this bim, this uh, the trap pretty much uh, uh, on that spot. Okay. But you see on the ledges on the side, you, there is a half meter space where you can walk to cross it. You also see uh, Eilie... In here, you see Galleon, you know, who, who is brandishing his, his axe. What hammer, do you do? Hammer. Hammer, sorry. Um, I, I, so. Yeah. 
Oh, can... how long is your invisibility for? 20 minutes. OK. So I say, hey. <laughs> hey. I'm just going to look shocked and and uh, try to stay focused. <laughs> I'm like, hi. Focus. What, what's going on? Looks like the, the thugs that jumped Galleon are in there. Oh, okay. Well, how would you know that? Oh, I guess. I guess. I heard, remember. right? Yeah, you heard. You yeah, heard. yeah, I agree. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, motherfuckers. <laughs> And they're gonna eat my hammer. Ah. As soon as it's my turn. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I need I need to make sure that I'm doing this. Uh, I I missed on one of the abilities of the characters, but that's fine. I'll I'll start doing it now. Okay. So, uh, uh, Faye, what are you what are you, what are you gonna do? You still have four movements. Do you want to just stop, stop there? Well, if I can, I stop on the ledge because that's yeah like... yeah you can stop on the ledge. Mm, no, I'm gonna stay here. Like I can oh. see it's a ledge, right? Sure. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Well, stay there. Wonderful. Uh, next uh, is Eileen. So I'm going to move. Oops. Ah. Just right. move your character. Yep. Well, sorry. Nope. Here. Hmm. I think I can move there, right? Mm, uh, yes. Yes, you can. You can because it's uh, the door is on those two. Uh, it, it's, it, it's a big door. So, yes, you get there and you cannot shoot because you expanded your full movement, right? Jess, you are, you are disconnected. Yeah, you need to re-log. OK. Uh, Galian, let's, let's play you since uh, she is. She's having issues. I guess so, you know what she's she's done. She's done. Okay. Yeah. Um, so she did two, four. Actually, this is this is ten. You can still act, Jessica. Okay. But the uh, way she, but the way you did it, showed that you did fourteen meters. That's why I was like, yeah, because I went back, back and forth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So it's hold on. Two, my screen four, is still loading. Six, eight, I can't see anything yet. Ten. Okay, there we are. Whew! Sorry stressful so um i'm still camouflaged can i actually not oh. camouflaged anymore oh okay. yeah because because you you know there, there is no spot for you to hide if you okay if you stayed here just so you know if you stayed here if you just moved here and looked from from the door you had the wall covering you so you can use camouflage for that got it okay you can, if you'd like, you can go back and do that. But that's the last time yeah. that, I'm, that I'm doing this for you. No, that's no, that's fair. I, okay. okay, sounds good. So um, I want to take aim at that guy. All right, so you're going to do your snipe shot at him? Yeah, with, um, uh, with a normal arrow? arrow. A normal, a normal arrow. arrow. Okay. Uh, so make sure to take out your EP. You're gone, Ahmed. You're gone. You're disconnected. Yeah. Uh, by the way, just so you know, guys, uh, if you hover over your webcam and there is a button on top right of the webcam called reconnect, that doesn't require you to refresh the whole uh, page. Ah, yeah. Do you see yes. what I mean? Yeah. Ahmed. I'm back. Yeah, this is okay. also for you, Ahmed. If you hover over your webcam, there is a, re a refresh button on the top right of your webcam. It, it it's okay. A, it's an auto reconnect without having to reload the whole assets. Oh, gotcha. I don't see it. I don't know where my webcam thing is. No, it's where you are. Like no. The, yeah, you uh, you, see, you see where your face is. Your video. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> At the top right corner. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah yeah yeah. Oh I see. Yeah. All right, so so you're starting to aim. That's what you said, right? Yep. Wonderful, Galleon, it's your turn. <clears throat> Well, uh, two, four, six, I come here. And I swing my hammer at the guy in front of me. Okay. Hey, hey, uh, shot. So, what's that? <laughs> no, I rolled the tree, so that's why I said that. Uh, you have a plus one for your total yeah, because yeah. you best attacked him uh, yeah, earlier. Yeah. Uh, so he rolls a one. 
<laughs> okay, so anyway, he's gonna take the damage from Tini. He's gonna take the damage. Please go ahead and um, uh, so that's uh, eight damage, right? Ten. Uh, no, that's no, ten well, damage. Two, uh, no. no, not minus two. This one is stronger. He has uh, four. So you do you did four damage. Okay, and I attack the guy next to him with the disadvantage. Uh, Please go ahead and roll it. So he's gonna uh, try to do... twenty-seven. Wonderful. Let me dodge. So you, you said how much you rolled? 20... 27. 27. 27. Yeah, yeah, you're successful. So um, you deal another 10 damage, but this one is 8. So 12. All right. So you hit, you hit both, both of them. Um, the lackey on the left doesn't look good uh, after, uh, after you hit. All right. Uh, uh, next. Uh, yeah, okay. The, the on the left. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. on the left. Yeah, because I saw the ping on the one next to uh, you, guys. that's why. Oh, sorry. Uh, Sol... Wait, is it Solster? Yeah, it's Solster. So, yeah. end, end of round one, this is round two. Yeah. You, best. what do you do? Uh, bonus action to pick up the sword, right? All right, so you pick up your sword. And then uh, I attack this guy. Okay, so please go ahead and um, make a roll. And uh, before I do that, I want to ask you how long it's been since I lost my ability to use the magic. Or you told me 25 15, minutes. So. No, 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 no. 15 minutes. Uh, yeah. No, no, 25 minutes, uh, Usama, is since you became invisible. Oh, okay. That's that's different. So 20 minutes. I would say about 20 okay, minutes. Thank you. So I attacked the guy. <laughs> oh, oh, c'est propre. <laughs> 30 damage. Oh, yeah. Nice, oh, boy. Nice. Oh, boy. So, so, so you best. You rolled uh, a critical. You want to kill him? So basically, like I slice him sideways, and since I'm doing uh -huh. like a seasoned fighter, with that same swing, I'm gonna attack the other guy. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. So, uh, so this one. let me just recheck one one more thing. Yeah, yeah. you deal. Um, how much damage do you deal? Thirty. So fifteen. Uh, the base one is fifteen. Times so two. thirty damage. Yeah. No. No. You cut. You cut him in half. Yeah. So that that one is uh, is done. It's cool. Gone with yeah. the wind. Yeah. One second. All right. So, uh, what? what, what uh, who's the other one you're attacking? Just ping him again. Yes. I didn't see. Okay, the one next to it. Yeah. Uh, please go ahead and uh, roll for that one as well. <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah. Person. So, so you try. You know, you you swing the, you cut the first guy. Turn around yourself, and with the speed you went at, you tried to hit the second guy. He jumps, and your sword gets thrown away. <laughs> All right, so uh, that was uh, your turn, and you're disarmed uh, again. Next after you is the red brand that just got killed. Uh, so it's the red brand next to him, and the one next to him is going to attack uh, Galleon. So this guy is going to attack you. Shit. He came at me. <laughs> yeah, so he hit you with eight damage. All right. <laughs> How does your armor look? Uh, it's okay. It's not uh, shiny, but it's fine. Still good. Oh, okay, like 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 when you say still good, are we talking? Uh, you know, like good is seventy percent. Yeah. Uh, uh, mediocre, uh, not mediocre. Average is fifty percent, etc. So you're uh, good. Good. I'm you're good. about good. I'm good. I'm okay. looking good. My armor is like eh, easy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Keep enjoying this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like so uh, that was that uh, red brand, and then uh, the thug orders that same red brand to attack you again, Galleon. Ah. Uh. So. He's just gonna come at you, but this time with a disadvantage. So, okay, let's do this. Here's number one. Here's number two. So, twenty-nine. I did uh, against the nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Nope. So you're still successful. Yeah. You're able to block it. Yeah. All right. So that's uh, that's what he did for his bonus action, and then he gets in. Uh, well. Let's see. He jumps over the um, sarcophagus. Uh, the, sar the sarcophagus. No. That's uh, four. That's eight. 
and that's for a10 yep so he moves this way <clears throat> all right uh next is the lackey up north and he is going to swing at uh, you uh you bus and he rolls another one come on you bus 20. Uh, ah okay what? so you're able to uh dodge his um strike and as he is trying to hit you his sword hits the ground and it's um he's disarmed oh uh Ahmed, i just thought What's about up? something you didn't What's pick up, up your uh, knife when you attacked me you mean the guy who got killed ah it was the guy who got killed not the other one <laughs> no. ah yeah. shit the, the other one has a sword not a knife the one ah, that okay, got okay. killed had uh the one had a knife. okay yeah God damn it <laughs> All right, next uh, next one is Faye. Um, I'm hearing all of that, like sound of fighting. Yes. Uh, I move here. All right, so you get inside, and then you see um, a red brand on the floor who who's dead. Uh, you see two red brands fighting um, Sol and Galleon, and you see a a thug, a red blank thug, on here. What okay. do you do? Um, I'm going to attack this guy. With what? Uh, with. Uh, um chaos bolt sure okay let's uh see how that goes i'm gonna try to dodge so you're successful you rolled a 27 he rolled a 24 so you lash you heard that um pink arcane bolt of energy that or say, sorry, pink chaos balls at uh, that individual, and let's uh, roll the effect. Uh, w first is the damage, so one d six for the damage, and then the magic against his strength, agility, or magic. Mm -hmm. So for that one, I'm rolling. Ooh. Of course, another one. <laughs> yeah. So uh, it works. Uh, you deal 15 damage to him, and he has. Let's see how much does he have in armor. Damn, that was a lot of ones and uh, 20s. God damn. <laughs> she does. Okay, so you you throw your um, uh, pink energy uh, chaos ball that hits the red brand, and as it hits him. It explodes as a pink liquid that falls on him and starts, you know, to eat at his um, armor. And you could see that it it hurts. It hurt him. That was um, that was actually dangerous. You did you dealt fifteen, right? Fifteen minus. Uh... Yes, that's correct. So it hurt him quite a bit, and you could even see the skin um, that's getting burned by the the perp uh, the or uh, the pink liquid and from that liquid it starts coagulating and another one comes out and the, uh, the other the lesser bolt goes to who do you aim at uh the whatever like he is next to him okay the guy next to him all right so please roll uh, magic attack again and then he's going to try to dodge no it's magic not magic attack but it's okay i did it no it's magic attack for the second is another magic attack Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, because you're throwing a magic attack at the, at the next guy. And he rolls a 25. So wh what's your total with your magic attack? No, no, I'm glad you said. I think we're miss. I think you were, you were miss. If, I think you forgot what the spell looks like, and then we're missing some steps. So I'm gonna read it to you, okay? So I just want to make no, no, sure. No, no, no. I, I know what it is. It's, oh, okay. You throw, you throw a, a magic spell. It hits the person, then you do an effect to see if another bolt is going to come out. When the other bolt c comes out, you do another magic attack. 
Yeah, yeah, but we didn't we didn't do the test to see if another boat. We did. I rolled a one. Oh, so you mean you? Oh, okay. Uh, you're yeah, talking. I rolled a one. Gotcha. That's. Well, did you? Did you I, I didn't know. Did you roll or not? You didn't roll. I, no, I did not roll. I rolled only the d6. What, what's the eleven plus sixteen? That's my magic. That's my magic. That, okay, that, so it that worked. That's that, yeah. what I was talking about. I saw okay. eleven against sixteen. Okay. So now do a magic attack roll against the second person, and my total is um, twenty. What was it? Twenty-five plus one. So that's twenty-six. Twenty-one. So you miss uh, the next. The next guy. Was he attacked by anybody in that turn? No, not yet. He was. He was attacked by Galleon. Okay, so just one. Twenty-two. Okay. Yeah, no, Galian and Yubas. I think both of them, because Yubas did seasoned fighter on him. So yeah, you have a plus two against him. That's still just twenty-three, so it's not enough. Yeah, yeah, you need you need you needed much more than that. So, but but anyway, you you still hit this guy pretty badly. All right, so that's your turn, Ailey. Yes. Hi. Yeah. I'm gonna shoot this guy. Uh, I've been aiming at him. Yeah, so you use your snipe shot. Uh, take out the EP and then uh, please yep. roll. Uh, and you have a bonus of plus three to your roll. He's going to try to dodge. Yeah. Oh, funny. So 31, both of us, but Jessica, you have a plus three. Yep, 34. Because the other, because the other people have... Um, have uh, attacked him as well, so he is unable to to react. He he tries to react, but he's not fast enough. Um, as your arrow, you want to kill him? I'm assuming, right? Yeah, yeah. It was a critical it, strike, yeah. Oh sure, yeah. Well, but uh, he didn't have enough HP to survive yeah. it. Uh, it was a normal arrow, right? Yep. Yeah, he, he was not going to be able to survive it. So he yeah. takes twenty damage as your arrow goes through his throat. <laughs> And he falls to the ground dead. I'm going to turn to Faye and say, it's good to have you back. I knew I couldn't leave you guys alone five minutes. That's yep, that's something stream, that's right. Stream of bodies everywhere. Yeah. All right, Galen, it's your turn. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to move. Oh, do I move, actually? No, uh, I can hit this guy right from here. Yeah. No, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use hard-headed on him. Uh, okay, sounds good. Uh, so uh, he's going to try to dodge. Hard-headed on this guy. Shit. Uh, you try to grab him, but he's able to barely dodge it. Um, so you miss it. Make sure to take out the energy points yeah. as you, you do that. All right. Um, next is Soul. So it's a third round. Yeah. Uh, in this case, can I use my bonus action to get the sword? Sure. Yeah. So you pick up your sword with your bonus action. <clears throat> and I attack this guy first. Sure. He's going to try to dodge. He rolls a two. He rolls a 13. You're successful, and he takes uh, 15 damage minus 2. 13. So you slice at him, you hit him on the right side, you know, it cuts through his uh, shoulder, the blood starts coming out, you know, like, he he's realizing that things are gonna, uh, are going downhill, especially that their boss just got killed. And I use Season Fighter on the second guy. All right, sounds good. The other one is going to try to dodge as well. And he has a 28. You have uh, a 30, so you're able to slash at him. You, you hit... Oh, uh, this one... Yeah, you kill him. So the second one, you thrust at him and you impale him uh, on your sword as <laughs> he dies. That was gore. He falls to the ground. Where is the sun? Yeah. All right. So that was uh, that was that. Next uh, is the lackey. That's who is dead. Next is the red band. Who is dead? So it's the last lackey. It's that dude. Um, 
that guy moves, so he moves in this position. Move this body. And he swings at um, Galleon. Okay. That's 17. Uh, versus uh, 33, so he's unable to hit you. You block it. You block him. Damn right. Damn right, baby. Damn right. And we end with Faye. Well, not end. The game is still on. But Faye, what do you do? Uh, I move here mm -hmm. and I attack him. You what? And I attack him. Did you uh, have you drawn your sword? Yeah, I never sheeted it. Sheeted the sword. I drawn the sword. Way when we were in the tunnel. Okay, sounds good. Then uh, please go ahead uh, and roll. He's gonna try to dodge, and you have a plus one to your attack. So, um, hold on, because I should have. I have plus one for each ally surrounding my target. So mm -hmm. I have plus two for the two guys, plus one because he got attacked, so we're equal. Okay, so you guys are equal. Okay, we're going to reroll then. Uh, he... Ooh. No, you're successful because ah, yes. you, uh, you have the plus three again. All right, so the two of you came very close. You, 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 as you got closer to him, you slashed at him, and he tried to dodge, but he, he was so close, but you still got him. You were able to, to, to hit him. Um, Usama, do you want to kill him or not? I don't. Okay, so here's, here's what I decided to change, because you can't just say, I don't want to kill him when yeah. we're attacking. So yeah. what we're going to do is you're going to do another melee, melee roll against the difficulty factor. And if you're successful, you do not kill him. If you are unsuccessful, you kill him. Yeah, that's fair. That's, uh, yeah. that's reasonable. Okay, so um, the difficulty factor at this point is going to be 13. So I can just use the melee attack against him again, right? Like using the quick buttons? It sure, work, right? sure. Sure. 13 plus 8, that's 21. 2 plus 16, that's 18. You, you stab him. There is something that, you know, you try to stop the urges, but at the same time, you're, you're, and, and, and you know why it is the case. Your sword is actually dealing 15 damage. Right I know. Now, I know. It's at night. So know. your sword seeks blood, and blood each other gets as you slash at him, cut, barely, like, slightly cutting his throat. But it's enough for him to to bleed uh -huh. and die as he drowns in his own blood. And you guys have finished them. Please make sure whoever has killed a person to note that in their uh, in your notes. And you just have finished murdering them. Do you want to search the room before we stop the session or do we want to just stop the session now? And the session um, too. Can I just tell a stupid joke to the to the group? Sure. It's going to be weird. Um, guys, Adabra is going to kill us. <laughs> <laughs> sure. And then I say... And then I'm the only one laughing. <laughs> and then I say not if we kill her first. <laughs> no, <just kidding. laughs> sure. Um, Osama, uh, so you gain uh, one, two, three, four. No, yeah, that's four. You get uh, you reduce your balance by four. Okay. Uh, do, but none of you has answered me. Do you want to search the oh. room or do you want to just finish? Yeah, okay, let's, let's, yeah, yeah. let's quickly just search the room, the bodies, and split the student. Okay, so on uh, the bodies, uh, they all have short swords, just FYI. Uh, Galian, I'm surprised you didn't say anything. Uh, what? Well, to them, because those are the people who have uh, kicked your ass, you know? Man, uh, I'll tell them motherfuckers at the beginning, and then the hammer did the talking. <laughs> the, yeah, I guess, I, guess, I guess the hammer did the talking, indeed. <laughs> so, 
that's the way to look at it. I, uh, I get that. All right, so we had two of these morons. So that's uh, D6 times 2, D10, 2, D6. Okay, so that's 4, D6, 1, D10. All right, 4, D6, and 1, D10. 4, D6, 1, D10. You, you find 22 gold pieces on the, the people you have beaten up. Uh, the red brand... Um, Thug, this guy, mm -hmm. right here. Uh, he his armor is still relatively intact. It gives six uh, physical protection, and it has fifteen durability on it. In case one of you doesn't have a good armor, um, and no, you cannot put it in your backpack for whoever wants to uh, take it. But in case somebody needs an armor, that one can be salvaged. Um, so that's what you find on the bodies. And uh, Jessica, if you have any arrows, you can pick them back up if they're not yeah, broken. They're all broken. Got you. All right. So in the crypt, uh, um, the experience. Oh, oh did sure. We, yeah, do yeah, we yeah. want to search the uh, sarcophagus? Sarcophagi? Okay, one second. One, two, three, four. Four and three, that's seven. Okay, you get... Uh, no, 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 hold on. Yeah, you get seven points of experience, uh, everybody. The passage de level for this one? Yeah, 200. Okay, so nice. We're going to do it next time. Um, All right, wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because you were not in that no, uh, I wasn't not there. fight. All right, so... The stone lid uh, of each sarcophagus is carved to depict the person entombed within. So you see two human fa um, human male faces here and here, and one female in here. Uh, they seem to be the the depictions of nobles. Okay. Uh, so you seem very well versed into religious stuff. Maybe you should uh, take the sarcophagus if they have something special. Yeah, do you want to do this now or do you want to do it for next time? Well, he said you said like you want to clean up this thing now and yeah. the next time you move to the next room or whatever. Yeah, but I was just talking about loot. But, but uh, can I roll a d100 for the uh, religious? Uh... Uh, what are you trying to do with uh, your religion, just so I understand? What are you trying to do? Uh, well, Galen asked me if I could uh, see. I'm asking you what do you want to do. Uh, Explain to me what do you want to do with your religion thing. Uh, if the way the sar sarcophagus are uh, have any uh, be uh, like the way they're carved and the way they're structured and the way the bodies are like arranged, is it like part of? Well, yeah, you didn't. It's not open. The sarcophagus, uh, uh, the sarcophagi are are closed. Oh, so so it's. I not... said there is carvings. There is carvings, oh, carvings. on the. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's what I said. There is there is carvings. That depicts the the persons in, entombed within mm. two human males and one human female, okay. and all look like noble in the carvings. Okay, so maybe not religious. Um, actually, can I use both my uh, background and also uh, the religion in in both ways? Hello, can you can we open them? Can we can can you help me open them? Like I move towards this guy and I say, can you can we open this please? All right, uh, as, uh, as you get close to do that, you best make a religion test. Uh, you have a plus 10 bonus to that. Okay. Oof, failed. You failed, okay. So, you know, like you're still thinking about what, um, you know, what you, you, you are thinking about as Osama gets in. So what are you opening? You open that sarco sarcophagus next to you, Osama, I'm assuming? Yeah, I mean, I try at least. I don't know if there's a strength test associated with it. Or... No, there is none. So you you push it to the side. It's 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 a little a, a teeny bit heavy, uh, but not not much. Uh, you are able to push it. It contains uh, mostly moldering bones and scraps of clothing okay. on the one. So like there is the, the person that was die dead in here was dead a long time ago. And that's the one that was by uh, where you are, right? So there are two. So are you talking about this one? Uh, well, I'm talking about the one here. Okay. That's the one where your character is standing next to. 
All right, so that's what you do, other players, you bus included. Did you figure out what you wanted to? So if, if I want to still reanalyze, is that possible or not? Analyze what? What are you trying to analyze? I'm asking what are you trying to do so that I can tell you if it's easy or hard or etc. Uh, like the the history of like the the style of the carving or the uh, the sarcophagus itself. Does it have any depictions to any religion that I know of? Uh, sure. Um, you have a plus ten to the percentage roll. Okay, never mind. Damn. Okay, you fail again. All right, you have you have no idea, um, and it's probably because for some reason it's getting dark again. <laughs> it feels too too dark in here, and you know that uh, when you open a sarcophagus, what's inside is probably going to be pretty dark, you know, because it's sarcophagus. <laughs> uh, Galian, what are you going to do? Uh... Well, no, I'm not gonna open the sarcophagus because um, my character is not. Uh, uh, I mean, I'm not at ease with opening uh, uh, sarcophagus of dead people. So I'm like, uh, do whatever, but I'm not part of this. Okay, uh, Ivy, like, what uh, do you want to do? No, I'm not gonna open it either. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, Osama, we're back at you. Can I um, can I can I do an analysis test to see if there's any. You know, besides what you described, if there is anything hidden or if there's any... So do you want to search? Do you want to, like, move the bones and, 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 and look? Or do you yeah. want to just look from your angle? Okay, so that's... Um, you you want to do a perception roll. And because you're moving the bone, the difficulty is um, eight. A perception roll? Yeah, perception. Okay. So eight plus two, that's 10. You need to roll more than one. You're successful. So as you are looking around, you didn't you didn't really find anything uh, of value. Uh, you get you get a sense of this uh, sarcophagus was probably looted already by the the red brands or whoever uh, was here. However, um, when when you moved the sarcophagus uh, the top, and as you loot, and as uh, you know, you're trying to loot, and you didn't find anything, you raise your head. You notice that the guys were playing dices on on this sarcophagus and you could see that there is about um, there's a pouch with about with about uh, 50 gold pieces on top so that's what the guys were playing uh, and you notice also that there is a, a platinum uh senior ring with the same heraldry as the sarcophagus you said a ring yeah, there is a, uh, a platinum senior ring. Okay. That's what you find. Okay. Well, I tell I, sh I, I tell the group I found a pouch with twenty uh, fifty gold pieces in it, and um, I found this ring. Um, uh, I don't touch this. Uh, keep that. I don't want it. Okay. Uh, so, do you want your share of the gold pieces? Yeah, sure. Uh, Ailey? Yes. Thank you. Okay. All right, so that's so, 50. You're going to split it by three. Yeah, so... 15 each, or 16 each, I guess, and two gets two more pieces, whatever. Yeah, it's 16 each, and two get, uh, two people get one more extra piece. So, so, who are the two who are getting the extra piece? I know I am because I. Sol and Fei. <laughs> Sol and yeah. Fei. Okay, so Sol and Fei, uh, you get 15, 16, uh, Sorry, seventeen. And Jessica, you get sixteen. Uh, what do you do with the the platinum signet ring? Put it in my uh, backpack. All right, sounds good. Um. Yeah, put in your pa in, in your pa in your backpack. Uh, Tresendar hair uh, heirloom. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put it like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So you have uh, finished cleaning 
it up. Is there anything else you'd like to do? Uh, are you talking to me? Uh, to the team. I opened the other sarcophagus. I don't know what they're doing. I'm opening the other sarcophagus. Uh, I, okay. I, I look at Faye and I'm like, there is nothing in there. Just don't stop desecrating the dead. Yeah. Uh, you added one, two, three, four bodies to the dead. I so, said uh, uh, desecrating the dead, not like, oh. that's nothing to do with it. These are like I, nobles. These are nobles, and these guys have been here before, like before us, the Red Band, they probably looted everything. So what you what you're looking for is not in there. Just leave it. Be. And I look at you and I say, you think it's normal that in a place where there is nothing, there would be four four people just sitting around. Fine, just do whatever you want. Okay. So I open okay. the other sarcophagus. Okay, so you're gonna open both of them. Anybody else helping him or is he doing it on his own? Uh, I'm not touching the dead people. Okay, da Jess, I, I can't hear you. No, I'm not helping. Okay, all right, uh, Usama, just do, um, you, you're going to just do perception, right, to, to try to see. You're, you're going to do the same thing. You're going to try to see if there is anything hidden, right? Sure. Okay, so uh, you're going to roll against eight again. Uh, just do two rolls, two perception rolls. I'm going to roll twice. Um, uh, 16, and the second one is... Um, well, the first one were equal at Usama, because it's four and twelve, and I have I rolled a sixteen, I think. Yeah, so sixteen on the first one, and the second one fifteen. So the second one is a failure. Um, the first one you gotta reroll it. Four. Okay, you're, you're successful on the first one. So uh, as you are looking and scrambling and trying to fake the same thing, bones. These these um, sarcophagi guys have been have been looted for sure. You know, like the the red brands or whoever. If there was anybody before the red brands, they have they have looted them long ago. And as as you are exploring, not exploring, but like searching, you're you're confident that there is nothing else hidden here. You are muted. That there's nothing hidden okay i just i close them back up like the mm -hmm. way they were uh, mm -hmm. before i disturbed them okay all right uh and i'm assuming this is going to be the end of the session right uh, i guess yeah okay wonderful all right so so this is uh this is done usama you're gonna write in your description uh in your character sheet you're gonna write this favor with the god of death and put uh, six next to that. This favor with the god of death. Yeah, you're gonna put six. Uh, soul and mud. You're gonna put this favor with the god of death, and you put one each one of you. And that's the end of the session. You uh, Who else leveled up? Is there anybody who's at uh, two hundred uh, XP? I did. Okay, good. Uh, you, uh, Jessica, you are, are you at 200 XP or not? Yeah, you are. All right. Uh, I will talk to each one of you separately for the leveling up. Does that sound good? Yeah. Yes. Sounds good. All right. Thank you.